Hey, players, if you've ever seen a girl that you wanted to talk to but froze up when you had the chance, you are not alone. Tons of guys everywhere deal with this problem. So, hopefully by the end of this video, you'll know exactly what to say to fix it. Let's backtrack a little and establish what an opener is. Whenever you need to start a conversation with someone or get the attention of a crowd, you'll usually use an opener to captivate your subject. The function of an opener is ideally to keep them interested in what you're saying or doing. Let's say you're in school and there's an attractive girl in your class. What can you say to her that'll get her attention? A lot of people think that using scripted openers isn't genuine and is just not indicative of who they are. They're afraid that saying something canned will leave them with no follow-up, and the truth is that just isn't true. Plenty of people use scripted openers, magicians, comedians, even the president. Hold on, so back to the attractive girl in class. Should I plan something to say to her? What if she doesn't like what I say? For some odd reason, people tend to separate romantic communication from every other type of communication in their life. They sometimes feel that getting help in this specific subject is somehow different from getting help in anything else. Why is it so shunned upon for people to get advice on how to talk to girls? I've heard the claim that it should just come to you naturally. Well, guess what? That's just not how society works. If I'm playing football and I'm practicing a play over and over and over just to get it right, does that make it any less credible than winging it on my own? The reason scripted openers work is because they've been tested before. The same way that a comedian will test his jokes or a magician will test his tricks. Whoa, 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 back to this pretty girl scenario. When is it right to ask her out? Do I tell her from the get-go how I feel? Is it too much to ask? Guys just want to know the right thing to say that'll make the girl like them. And then you can ask, does practicing what you're going to say over and over make it any less real? I mean, what is the perfect opener? Okay guys, here it is. I want you to get up and walk right to the girl. Make your way over and look her directly in her eyes. Once you do that, she'll be dying from the anticipation. And then I want you to say, I don't like you very much. And then you walk away. No, 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 seriously, here's my real advice. People tend to get so hung up on the perfect of everything. The truth is, there is no perfect opener. Sometimes when you go up to people, they could be tired or nervous or bored, or maybe they're looking for someone to talk to. You don't really know. And in all those situations, how they feel like responding to you is completely out of your hands. So why bother worrying about how they're going to respond to you? Instead, try this. Try having fun. That is really it. Have fun with everyone you talk to. The perfect opener is not in what you say, it's in how you feel. If you approach someone intending to get a specific result, you will lose. Think of it like this. You approach a person with a fun attitude. You share a story and you ask them questions about what they think on things, but they just aren't being responsive. Whoa, it's not working out like I intended. What do I do? Who cares? You're having fun. That's what matters. Don't approach someone because you want to get one thing out of them, whether it be their phone number or asking them out on a date. Approach them because you want to learn about them as a person. People can offer you so much if you just let them. So stop focusing on the right thing to say at the beginning of the conversation. More often times than not, hi works perfectly fine. There I go again with that perfect word. Huh. Like this video if you think the best way to approach someone is to be yourself and have fun with it. Leave a comment letting me know what are some of your biggest fears when approaching someone. And subscribe to the channel for more videos on how to get girls, how to dress your best, and more fun stuff like that. As always guys, love and peace. Yo, with those space pants, cause your ass is out of this world. Girl, you must be tired cause you've been running through my mind all day. This smell like chloroform? Jesus Christ, God did me a favor by bringing you here, so I'm sending him back an angel tonight. Alrighty then, I think I went a little too far.